Welcome back everyone. We continue with Alien Isolation. My timer is set. We save and we continue. We just got the well mission to go to medical. Go to trans engineering transition. Well it doesn't matter which one I take. Solomon's habitation tower, Lawrence says tech. What does it go to San Christopher Medical Physician? I think it was Solomon's, I think, but I'm actually not sure. So there's like, let's say 10 more aliens around. I truly did not enjoy that level. Darn swish. Motion tracker can be heard if you're close to enemies. That explains something from the start of the series. Am I at the sesame tower? I don't think I am. Oh, actually it's, it's Psy slash medical, not sesame. <laughs> Alright. I did take the wrong. Managed to get to comms? I'm here, but I was too late. Apollo's recovered from the reactor purge and knocked out external comms again. Damn it. So why'd you send me here? Plan B, Rip. See, before I left, the system showed a ship approaching Sevastopol. I think it's the Inisadora. Marlo managed to send out his auto codes to call me in while comms were temporarily open. We've got to get to it. Is it docking? No, but it's in a holding position nearby. Head for the ambulance bay. The shuttles are really short range, but they'll make it. Got it. Hmm. Oh, fuck. You. Somewhere all the way over there. So I guess we're going back into sneak mode. And sneak mode. Back 
Bang it harder against the wall. So I guess I can cut through there now. events. So, what secrets are here? Oh! Compound... Use the C Nostromo. Use its ransom. That just got your query. Yes, I have been in our transmission relay archive and I've done some decrypting. I'm looking for crew logs that passed through Sevastopol a while ago. I know you're concerned, but it's ancient history. It's just some stuff I need to know. A routine company transmission packet sent from the edge of Thetis before a ship started its trip home. Nothing that's gonna break anything. Ripley's asked me to lie a report on what happened to the umbilicus when we looked onto the refinery. I'll tell you what happened. Me and Brad were holding the place together with our bare hands. You'd think millions of tons of oil would get someone from the front deck. Someone on a full share down here with us. You know, check it up on the stuff we need. You want to get out of the system on schedule next time, you put the Nostromo in dry dock for a month. You wait till we're done with it. You'll pay what we're due. Park her out. Ripley's asked me to lie a report on what happened to you mm, okay. when we looked onto the refinery. I'll tell you what happened. Me and Brad were holding the place together with our bare hands. You'd think millions of tons of oil would get someone from the front deck. Someone on a full share down here with us. You know, check it up on the stuff we need. You want to get out of the system on schedule next time, you put the Nostromo in dry dock for a month. You wait till we're done with it. You pay what we're due. Park her out. Mm, a little bit more info about the Nostromo. Always good, I guess. Depending how you take it, it could be also be bad. Flame throw through. Thank you. I'll take it. Another chapter or floor winds can be used as alternate routes through the station. Look for the signature panels. Yep. Ah, oh, I guess I remember this place where the first bomb went up. I see a launch on my terminal. Models are already taken one of the shuttles. All right. Ah. Uh... Oh, come on. Really?
now with the torch I can access all... Oh, this is bad. But I bet the friend, the alien, can go in here with no problems. Sounds like the system check went okay. Some ducks still need rewriting, but as I keep getting told, there's not much we can do about it whether the Stromo is in the air. Parker's coming up with the sign-off sheets. But I know Ripley wants to chew his ear about the secondary load unit. I'm gonna stay out of it for now. They know what they're doing. Dallas Nostromo Captain signing off. Alright. Store power. This is dark. Dental surgery. My arch nemesis. Dentist. Mr. Wingard, my name is Julia Jones, and I'm a writer covering Sevastopol's decommissioning. I was hoping to interview you about your experiences on the station. You know, the limited medical resources, the mental effects on patients in deep space, that kind of thing. But look, Doctor, I've heard there was some kind of incident in the hospital recently. No one seems to know anything. Doctor, if there's a major public health issue here on Sevastopol, people need to know. I'm freelance, unbiased. I don't have any corporate affiliations. Let me be a friend to you. Call me. Well, I guess he never called. It's really a number on this place. So, there's an open laundry. I guess this door is not to open. Door locked. Ah, oh, it's my favorite place of all the places. So, quickest would be this, this, and then over there. They just be really quiet about it. Oh, scrap. Oh, there's an open door. This is new. It's a new door. This one I haven't opened yet. Use. ID tag. What's in here? Oh. What's with this room? There's nothing here. Oh, really? I'm not running. No alien hurt that? There we go. Would have been boring if it didn't hear that.
to the left. Okay, now I have to hurry. No. Sensor. Upgrade. I know you're there. Shit. You spice. So was this it? We get out, uh, Ricardo stays there, and done? Probably not. Ricardo, can you hear me? Nope. Save up. Explore. Wait. Ah, uh, kind of looks like aliens. The bastards. There shouldn't be any aliens on this thing, right? Well... Perhaps I can use a flare for some flare. Take it. Terminal. Tell me your secrets. Signal detector. Marlo Hey says he's just picked up some kind of signal. I got loose trying to call it now. Could be the Nostromo. Want to come up and see for yourself. Technician's report. 
2137 Marlow just had to do so much needed work on the sublight engines. The old girl was complaining so loudly I'm surprised something didn't fall off during the last jump. Everything's holding together now, but she'll need a full overhaul soon and we're not just gonna and not just for the core Simpsons. We keep pushing her like this and we're gonna end up being the only salvage crew hitchhiking through the deep space. It's gonna be an expensive job, so let's hope you're right about that beacon. It could be our last chance for a decent paycheck anyway. I had to reset the door code afterwards. The new one is 45010. We're outside Sebastopol. Marlow and Foster woke up first. She looked terrible. Meech and me are about to take a shuttle to the station. Oh well, this has got to break quality procedures, right? It's Marlow's ship. She's Marlow's life. And things got heated. And Meech's got a bloody nose. So, I don't know. Maybe the doctors will give her the all clear and things can get to normal. But if they sniff it out when we get on board, I don't want any part of it. Marlow doesn't e. think enough for that kind of noise. E. 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 More E. And some more. And hit that button. Door locked. this game. Ricardo, in case you're here now, I've got the Unicy World's basic power systems back on the Door should be open. Hopefully some light. Still no sign of morning. Marlo? Where are you, Marlo? Find Marlo. Google may have broken our losing streak. We've barely been scraping a living the past couple of years, and the Anissa door is starting to look like the wrecks we salvage. Can't say the crew's being currently any better. Then we found that flight recorder. It belongs to a ship, the Nostromo, Wayland Yutani property. That means there'll be a reward. So then Marlo had an even better idea. Extrapolate the path of the flight recorder to try to find the wreck of the Nostromo. We got lucky. Found a distress signal and now we're following it. This is it. I can feel it in my bones. He always said he'd do right by me. Oh, this is just gonna be horrible. This one? This one. Maybe you want to join my crew. Plenty of free spots. Taylor? Taylor! Marlo, what are you doing? What no one else seems prepared to do. Come find me, Ripley. I got something for you. I don't like this. No, no! F you! This looked familiar. Aliens, anybody? Did I just hear another one? That's just one, right? I want to access this terminal now. If I get face hugged. 
No, bad idea. Turn that off. So also, whatever it was that attacked us, that attached itself to Foster is dead. I found it on the floor by by her bed, all curled up like a spider. Foster said that she felt fine, but I insisted on putting her into hypersleep. That thing must have done something to her, but, but maybe I can slow the process. So that's the pause. The nearest station, so I'm going to get it checked out. Quarantine will be a problem, but I figured the Nostromo flight recorder may be the ticket in. Whatever we have to do. Anisa Dora, this is Marshal Waits of Sevastopol. Officially, I should deny your request to dock. Sevastopol is currently being decommissioned, and I can't compromise security for unscheduled vessels. However, in the light of the property you found, I will allow a small number of your crew to dock via a short-range shuttle. I must remind you that Sevastopol is entitled to a cut of any reward for return of said property once it's on station. Let me know your decision. Waits up. Everyone is just up for profits. Where's the compassion, you bastards? Sleep tubes. Oh, there's a safe station somewhere here. Let's use it. So, not much happening here. But it's a good time to stop this episode and continue from here in the next one. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.